it's just a little bit foggy today. Yeah. I should get one of these for the house. It's a very nice chair. This ship has so many beautiful details. From the 3D world map displaying the ship locations behind guest services to the Deck 3 elevator floor indicators, you are always discovering new details. There's also a gallery of artwork you can purchase on Deck 2. We had some time, so we took on another midship detective's case, this time with the Muppets. Hey, lucky break, detectives. Peter has something important to tell us. Use your device to suck Peter's words into the bubble vacuum. What does the word on the note mean? I'm not sure, but we do know the note was dropped at the scene of the crime. It might prove to be important. Let's write that word down and head to the next painting. Ooh, there sure are a lot of beach balls in the pool. Hey, too many have dressed me away. Mm -hmm. Unleash the water cannon. Yeah, and, and see if you can move those balls out of the way. Maybe there's a clue here. <gasps> a clue? Mm -hmm. Hang on, that one's not a beach ball. You found a stolen prop. There's my helmet. I could have used this for my 1.30 to 2 o'clock rehearsal. 1.30 to 2? What were you rehearsing? My solo flaming aqueduct stunt for the show. Come on! Hey, come on! Why? Aqueduct? That's interesting, detectives. Didn't we see the aqueduct in Bobo's security footage? You know, my girlfriend Camilla gets so upset every time I say aqueduct. <laughs> You think she'd be more upset about me jumping into a pool with a shark? Wait a minute, you put a shark in the pool? Well, he's not there anymore. He's up on the diving board. <laughs> hey, come on! It happened again! So the harbor tour gets rid of Kermit. All right, we'll be coming in. Harbor tour. Waldorf and Statler, yeah. and Benson Honeydew. Okay. 
Okay. Pepe, you home? Pepe's at home. Let me try your room key. Because I thought he talks at some point. Or no, I think maybe they did the call thing and that's out. Oh yeah, the Pepe thing. So <laughs> call some me that didn't do. So Fozzie did an excursion. Okay. So now we're down to Fozzie, Sam, Eagle, Camilla, Rolf, New Zealand, Beauregard, and Bobo. All right, we're hot on the trail, but it's time for us to do our beer tasting now. So we're gonna head down to Lounge 687 and try some tasty beers. We booked this tasting in advance. It was $45 per person. Okay, good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. How are we doing today? Last day of the cruise. I hope you guys had a fantastic cruise with us. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, how did the experience go? It's Is been it amazing. Nice. Nice, okay, so uh, I know it's 11 o'clock in the morning, but 5 p.m. somewhere else. Uh, I call this a breakfast of the champions. Anybody has done beer tasting with me before? Just Mr. Paul, and yes, sir. Thank you for coming again. I hope you liked it. I was, that means I was doing good, okay. Uh, okay, uh, without wasting any time, I can see you guys are thirsty. Uh, like I said, it's going to be a brief information of what we are, uh, what we're going to drink, and going to be more drinking, okay? <laughs> uh, because the captain don't need you, and you're not driving. Today. <laughs> okay. My name is Vivek. I'm from India. <clears throat> I'll be a beer host tasting tonight, uh, today, with my friend uh, Clifford from Philippines. Hello. Hi. Hello. 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 <clears throat> um, Welcome to Pub 687. I'm sure uh, till now you have known what the meaning of 687 is all about, why they named 687. So if you're not, just to refresh, uh, refresh you, it, uh, the name 687 is a whole number of a ship or an order number of a ship before they named uh, Dream. So 687 is, uh, is a signature beer of our pub. It's been um, brewed by a company called Terrapin. It was a Greek company was found in 2002, but now it's been taken over by Miller and Coase. Okay? It's sold out. Sold out, yes, but I'm, I'm all up today. Let's see. Let's see. And you guys must be wondering why we have such a very few selections because of the design of a cake. The European cake comes very big. Americans come in the battery, so there is no space, unfortunately. But again, it is what it is. I'm, I'm sure everybody is loving it. Yeah. Before I go to the uh, other beer, fun fact, any idea who is the first president of the United States, I mean, you guys know it, uh, <laughs> who brew his beer in White House? Bro, bro. Okay. No idea. Any guesses? Well, gives you two chances there. <laughs> <laughs> so, also two chances. chances. <laughs> so so whatever, whatever happens, it stays here, you don't have to be... Uh, you don't have to feel awkward, you can throw me any random answers, doesn't matter, okay? Any guesses, no? Miller to E. Fillmore. Oh, nice. Joe Wills. It was Barack Obama. Oh, wow. So Barack he used Obama. to brew his own beer in White House. Oh, it's closer with the Bush guys. Oh, yeah. I don't expect you to have a car there with down there for a few years. Damage done. That was fun. It was a lot of beer. <laughs> Fairly high alcohol. Oof. Oh, whoa! You found 
on Gertrude, my dear eyed fish. <laughs> What's this stuck to her? Mm. Mm. Now let's see if she flies. <laughs> Fly! <laughs> Hey, where, where's that stuff to Gertrude? Oh, a volunteer badge from the art auction. Another clue. Ah, there's a flyer with the names of all the Muppets who volunteered on the Muppet call board. Oh, good. Detectives, go to the Muppet call board. Oh, now. I should have taken a picture. Your map. That's why the lady took me to your art auction. Okay. Rolf, Bunsen, Honeydew, Sam the Eagle, and Camilla. So Fozzie was not. So we're down to Camilla and Rolf. We're gonna get ready to sound all those Mickey whistles. Whatever you choose to have. Well, she says she was practicing her big dance number, Poultry in Motion. Mm -hmm. Small barbecue. Like, what? 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 You're on fire! She's a liar, liar. Her pants on fire. She's hiding something. Let's go search Camilla's room. Is that legal? Who wants? International waffles. <laughs> Hurry, detectives. We'll meet you at the next painting. Get me. Get me. Call. So, so, do I know what you're writing? Yeah, I do. They did. They did. They did. Come on. We know you took the car. Oh, oh, oh. Camilla would never do such a thing. Uh, uh, it's true. Yeah. But, but why, Camilla? You know I'm performing my big stunt on the aqua duck. What? What? It's not a real duck, it's a water coaster. Camilla? You were jealous of a water coaster? That is so romantic. Look at me. That's so romantic. Come on, come here, come here. Right, here well, we have a problem with our big opening number. There's no one to set off our patented Muppet Lab indoor fireworks. Hey, detectives, you've all been so helpful. Why don't you set off the fireworks, okay? Thank you so much for uh, yeah. Vanellope's is the gelato, candy, and sweet shop on board. It's a really fun space. However, these treats are all an extra charge.
On the last day, we finally tried our hand at some trivia. Right. We have 20 movie quotes for a chance of 40 points. We need the character as well as the name of the movie. For so each question, we want two points. If you're ready to get started, say, oh yeah. Starting with number one, my panda, my choice, mom. My panda, my choice, mom. Character as well as the movie. <laughs> Best part of every Disney movie. Woo! So I want you right now to shout out your favorite Disney villain. One, two, three, go. Okay, I heard I heard a couple Jafars, I heard a couple Scars, Hades, that's the correct answer. But he's my favorite, so if you have any other favorites, they're just as good too, because they are the best part of every Disney movie. But now the time has come, my name is Ethan, I'm part of the entertainment team, or today I'll be your Disney villain of the Disney dream. Ooh, very exciting. But we're gonna see who the Disney villain of this trivia is. And our winner or winning team, you know, if you've done trivia before, there is a prize involved. Yes. And our winner or winning team will be going home with, drum roll, a goofy medallion. Everybody say, ooh. Everybody say, ah. Say, gosh. Fantastic job. You're all fantastic. You're just like Goofy. You're all hired, okay? But now, are we ready for question one? Yes! Here we go with our first one. It is a quote. Who said this? Well, well, well. What have we here? Sandy Claus, huh? Ooh, I'm really scared. So you're the one everyone's talking about. Have it or higher, I want to hear that best villain laugh. I want it to come from your chest, okay? I want it to be deep and evil. Well, our first trivia we didn't do so hot at. Second trivia a bit better, 14 out of 20. But yeah, we're not taking home trivia medallions anytime soon. We're not. We're not very good. Uh, but now we're gonna watch the Disney Dream, Making of the Dream uh, movie in the Evolution Lounge. So, very cool. For dinner, we had our final night at Animator's Palette and the much anticipated Draw Your Own Characters event. Thank <laughs> you. 
Disney dream. We wish you safe all the travels and we'll see you real soon. Good night everybody. So it's the end of the cruise. We just watched our final theater show. We just watched the See You Real Soon uh, cruise wrap-up show downstairs. Uh, we went to get some the last bit of soft serve from the soft serve machines and we got like, the machine was running out as we were getting ice cream. <laughs> so it's like, yep, it's time to go. Uh, we have breakfast tomorrow morning in, anima in Animator's Palette at 7 a.m. and then we will uh, leave the ship and that'll be it. This week has absolutely flown by but it's been amazing. It's such a great time on the dream and we're already looking forward to our next cruise. Thanks for joining us on this adventure uh, and, and, and coming along with us as we experience the Disney dream for the first time. We had an amazing time and we hope you've enjoyed it too. And uh, we'll catch up with you guys again real soon. We have some Awesome trips planned for the rest of this year into next year, so lots of more fun coming along. And we'll, we'll see you then. See you real soon. Thanks so much for coming along with us on this sailing. Remember to like and subscribe so you don't miss out on our future adventures. <laughs>